Seedy brother still doing here? He doesn't want to go home because it reminds him of honour. Well, at least he hasn't brought a couple of harlots round this morning. What weren't harlots? Oh, I'm so sorry. Did I offend you a bit on the side? Right, I was being Dave's wingman and I was pounced on, literally pounced on. Nothing happened. That is ready. Who wants pancakes? Uh, anyone got them up? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you think you were playing at last night, but I think that you are a foul excuse for a human being. You're a father, for God's sake. Middle-aged dads should not go around asking for wingmen. It's pathetic. Have a word, Ethan. A strong, aggressive word, because I might just kill him. And get him a mop. Oh, come on. Can't go out without my wingman, can I? Free drinks on me all night. Will you stop saying wingman? Right, why don't you go hang out with Mason or something? He's probably hanging out with his own mates. Why don't you open the loft and we can have ourselves a cheeky little looking? No, Dave. All right, do you really think going out and getting hammered every night is gonna, gonna what? Gonna help you get over honor? Right, spend some time with your kids instead of random women. Listen. My kids are practically adults. They don't want to see me. Well, newsflash, Dave. Sienna doesn't want to see you either. And ever since your little meltdown, we can barely go five minutes without having an argument. It doesn't help the fact that you've practically moved in. Uh, I haven't practically moved in. I'm just spending time with my little brother. I don't see what... Hello? What have we here? Is that what I think it is? The girls must have left it here last night. You cannot be serious, all right? Don't. Definitely not. Oh, come on. Might perk you up a bit, get you out of this dreadful mood. I am not touching that stuff, and neither should you. All right, I'm not being funny, Dave. You're not exactly a spring chicken anymore. It's been years since you touched it. You're probably going to cardiac arrest. How dare you? Get rid of it. I'm being serious. Because I was thinking that your dad could really benefit from spending some time with you guys. He could benefit. What about me? I'm the one playing mum for his laser, little sod. I never asked you to play mum. Plus, I can look after myself. Oh, OK, then. Well, you try putting in a wash every now and again, you little pig. OK. <laughs> yeah, but this could benefit all of us. Okay, so Dave has been crashing at my place like a parasite, and I really need for him to leave. <laughs> and you guys need your dad back, right? So... So what exactly are you suggesting? He just needs a little reminder of what's important. So I thought, nice family meal at my place. You now it could be a, a neutral ground and we could stage an intervention where you guys could really ham up how much you're struggling at home without him, you know, them being out all the time. Right, but why your place? Oh, we can't do it at yours, can we? Because it's a constant reminder of how broken your family is. I beg your pardon? We need to lure him back, yeah? Not remind him of all the reasons he didn't want to spend time there in the first place. I'm a really good cook. <laughs> and there'll be wine, good wine. Not this vinegar that Damon serves here. <laughs> Please? Hey, having a little soiree, are we? No, just me and my brother. Um, I heard about you and Honor. Wow. The people around here not have tellies or something. Look, I just wanted to let you know that, um, I've been there. Felix, I know you're trying to help, but, um, I don't want to talk about it. And I'm not trying to pry. I'm just want to say that I get it. You know, when Martine left, I had to do whatever I could to get through, you know? If it meant sometimes going a bit wild, then... I'm not going wild. They're not just for tonight. No! I know. I'm just saying if you do decide to go wild, then, um, go wild. I mean, to help with the people that think otherwise, I mean, what do they know, eh? Yeah, thank you. It's OK. All right, yeah. Liv, I need your help. Your vegan brownie recipe has bombed. They literally have no structure, so will you just call me back and... Oh, bye. Uh, you know, I think we should tell Dave his kids are coming here. Yeah, he doesn't really like surprises. Ethan, relax, he'll be fine. Although, where is he? Because they are going to be here in a minute. Mm, toilet, I think. Again? 
I think he has a UTI. Hey, I'll get him. Hey, hey, what are you doing, Eth? Oh, well, Tiana invited us over for tea to see you, but we can go if you like. No, 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 don't be stupid. Come in, come in, come in. It's just a surprise, that's all. How are you? Not as good as you are, I think. Hi, welcome. This is so lovely. It's such a nice surprise. <laughs> just, um, guys, I'm sorry I haven't seen you lately. It's, uh... Dad, it's fine. You don't have to... No, 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 no. I just, I'm... Try not to think about your mum so much and everything there reminds me of her, so... Dad, seriously, it's fine. <sighs> hey, no, 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 Sam? Uh, no, I think he's on his way. Oh, cool. Shimmy? No. No. OK, well, that's all right. That's cool. That's cool. Why don't you two go and sit down? Yeah, come on. So when I said get rid of that coke, right, I meant put it in the bin, right? Not take it yourself. <laughs> Listen, don't, we're having a nice time. Don't spoil it, huh? Mace, show us a magic trick. We got up sleeve. Well, I've been working on something. Has the um, boat, the uh, boat thingy. Love boat. Love boat. How is it? The boat's fine. Yeah, Damon's not giving you any any grief, is he? Because <sighs> so lovely to have you here. You're being weird. Your dad's just had. A lot of coffee, all right? He's not been sleeping since your mum left. So, hey, hey, why don't you go um, have a lie down now? Yeah? I work in a bar. Do you not think I know what it looks like when someone's high? I'm not high. Don't lie to me. Look at your pupils. You're up the wall. <sighs> Guys, I well, think listen, you should just lay off the whole thing. He's telling the truth. Yeah. Call off a little bit and we'll talk about well, it Daddy tomorrow. doesn't do drugs. He knows my dad was a junkie. That's the whole reason he adopted me in the first place. So I want to know right now why you think this is OK. If you're going through a midlife crisis, do what normal people do and go and buy a convertible or summer. How could you bring this into my home, Dave? What if my children have found it, hmm? Please, stop! So I did a bit of coke. Shoot me. What? Lizzie, I, 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 I get it about your old man, you know, but it's... Man, this is a million miles away from what he was doing. Do you know what I mean? This is just a bit of a laugh. A bit of a laugh? Who even are you? Mason, come on. Lizzie. Did you know about this? <laughs> Why am I even asking? Of course you did, wingman. Sienna, seriously, lighten up. Me and Ethan used to do coke all the time back in the day. I don't do that anymore. Kids, wait! 